Today, I'm going to walk you through an NVIDIA trade that you can do right now that has an 87% historical win rate with an 81.8% net profit. And here's the best part. It is small account friendly where your total risk is only $275 and the expected profit is $225. I'm going to spoon feed you this trade from start to finish and show you how to stack the deck in your favor with high probability trades. This is one of the most exciting trade setups I've covered, so make sure to stick around to the very end because I'm going to go step by step in this video and we'll even show you how to place the order to make sure you get everything right. Our stock today is NVIDIA and they are reporting earnings on May 24th after the market closes. In the last seven months, NVIDIA stock price has nearly tripled after having a very rough 2022. Now, some will argue that NVIDIA is becoming overvalued and it is trading at 25 times sales and 65 times the non-GAAP forward EPS estimates. I want to give you a clear warning that anytime you hold over earnings, you have an increased risk and can get burned. Most of the time, I like to wait until after earnings before I initiate a position and I have to classify today's trade as higher risk because it is holding over earnings. But I'm willing to take this risk because it has a high probability of winning and the historical data shows this trade wins a whopping 87% of the time. As always, if you enjoy step-by-step -step videos like these, make sure to drop a like and subscribe and ring that notification bell if you want to learn more from my channel in the future. And before we jump into today's video, I want to congratulate a few of our Discord members on their winners. All right, first up we've got Dom. Thanks, Jerry, and congratulations, Dom. They picked up a $188.25 profit on ONON, which is on running, and that worked out to a 449.9% return. Well done, Dom. Next up, we've got Tarzan. They picked up a 36.46% gain on the triple Q, and then we've got Beach Bums. They scaled out with a stop loss, one at 66, two at 85, and two for over 100 hundred percent profits. Extremely well done guys. Thanks you very much for sharing. This is what we do in my private discord and if you want all of our trading alerts and help from our awesome community then join us in the discord. I really believe we've got one of the best ones out there and if you want to join I'll put the link in the description below. Since this is a higher risk trade over earnings I want to walk you through why I like Nvidia. Using tip ranks, we can see 38 analysts cover NVIDIA and it's ranked as a strong buy. And check out the earnings history and we see that NVIDIA earnings are trending back up, which is a really good sign. Now let's go over a few highlights from Yahoo's article, NVIDIA expected to beat earnings estimates, can the stock move higher? Number one, estimate revisions trend. The consensus earnings per share estimate for the quarter has been revised 0.34% higher over the last 30 days to the current level. This is essentially a reflection of how the covering analysts have collectively reassessed their initial estimates over this time period. Number two, a positive earnings expected surprise prediction is a strong predictor of an earnings beat, particularly when combined with a Zacks rank number one, which is strong buy, two, a buy, or three, a hold rating. Our research shows that stocks with this combination produce a positive surprise nearly 70% of the time, and a solid Zacks rank actually increases the predictive power of the earnings ESP. And number three, the bottom line, NVIDIA appears to be a compelling earnings beat candidate. However, investors should pay attention to other factors too for betting on this stock or staying away from it ahead of its earnings release. And just for fun, since artificial intelligence is all the rage, check out this article. We asked ChatGPT what will be NVIDIA's stock price in 2030. The results are based on these factors and other market conditions. A possible trading range for NVIDIA's stock price by 2030 could be between $1,000 and $2,500 per share. Now, so far today, we've laid out a case on why NVIDIA is expected to beat earnings on Wednesday and how long-term NVIDIA is potentially a very good stock to buy and hold. Now we're going to use Market Chameleon, which is a great website that has free stock screeners, and I'm going to use the members only section to show you how we can take our investing to the next level by finding high percentage trades based on historical data. And if you want a free trial to Market Chameleon, I've included a special promo link for you in the description below. We're now in Market Chameleon and we're going to start with the Earnings Option Strategy Backtest Screener and you find this by going to Earnings and then you'll see it right here, Earnings Option Strategy Screener. Now let's go over the actual screener and how I've got mine set up. For this one, we're set up with the historical range to be any, our number of observations, we've got 12, 
our win rate above 90%, average return above 30%, best return any, and worst return 0%. And here you can see we've got 26 different entries that came up. And now we've got our underlying. This is our stock symbol. So we've got AZO, Costco, Dick Sporting Goods. Next, we've got our market cap, tells us how big the stock is. Strategy type, this is really important. Multiple different strategies we can use. On AZO, we've got a credit put spread. On Next, we've got on Costco, an iron condor. The historical range, this is when we want to open it, one day before, two days before, two weeks before. Historical close range, three days after, one week after. So this is breaking down our entire strategy, all the day details, when we want to get in, when we want to get out. Next, we've got the strategy backtest results section. We've got our number of observations. All of these are coming up with 12. Our win rate, check this out. 99% of the time, these trades were winners. Our average return on AZO, 30%. On Costco, 48%. Our median return, best return, and worst return, standard deviation, and the sharp ratio. And the sharp ratio, this is really good because the higher the ratio, the higher the likelihood of success. So you'll see if we've got like a 3.29, 99%, and if we had a lower percentage, you'd see that one coming through. Next, we've got our earnings information. Our next earnings date is going to be the 23rd of May, 19th of July, estimated. Our days to earnings, days to the next open, close, and that's our general information. And then if we wanted to size this down even more, we could go our historical open range and we could just go one day before and that will pull us up all of the ones that we could trade today and we'd only have three of them because these are all reporting earnings tomorrow. Next up, let's say you've got a stock that you like, in this case NVIDIA, you know it's got an earnings coming up and you want some trade ideas for it. All you do is put in the stock NVIDIA, you come over here to earnings and you click on today's trade ideas and that's going to give us today's actual earnings strategies for NVIDIA and here it's going to show the same information we just went over, our earnings date, the strategy type, the range for when we want to open it, the range when we want to close it and here we've got our number of observations. So all of these are different possibilities for us. AMC right here stands for after the market close and these are all potential trades. An extremely easy easy way to find historically proven trades with an average return, everything listed right here. And now I want to go over today's trade that we're going to do. And this is a trade that I plan on doing when the market opens, unless we have a real crazy market open. So the first thing we can do is we can put in NVIDIA. Then you come down to options and you can click on trade ideas. And here we can sort the top three by edge trade ideas for NVIDIA. And we've got number one is a bull put credit spread. We know it's a credit because it says credit right here. And this is telling us that we've got an 87% historical win rate and we've got an edge of 54.2%. Now, what is the edge? Real simple. We can come over here. This explains theoretical edge example by Market Chameleon. It explains everything and I just want to give you guys the main part. Theoretical edge is the expected average return per trade in the long term. So if you did this trade a hundred times, the theoretical edge is what your average return would be. And now let's go over our trade. We've got the scorecard right here. This gives us all of our basic information, the credit that we're going to receive, theoretical value, edge, historical win rate, and the actual trade right here. But what I really love about Market Chameleon is we've got detail that walks us through every step. All we have to do is click on the report and boom, it pops up for us. So here's what we're doing. It's a bull put credit spread. Our expiration is going to be the 2nd of June. We're going to be buying the $307.50 put. We're going to sell the $312.50 and that's going to be a $2.25 credit. So that means we'll make $225 per contract and our potential yield is 81.8%. And then we've got our payout diagram, which goes over everything. Our maximum gain is $2.25 per share, so $2.25 per contract. Our break even at expiration is $3.10.25, and our maximum loss is $2.75, so that would be $275 per contract. And here's our diagram. Next up, we've got the option strategy analytics. It goes over our theoretical value, theoretical win rate, and the theoretical edge. And then we've got the takeaway, and this tells us our stock behavior. All of the different areas on this one, all six are bullish. And you can pause this video and read each of these if you'd like. Or what you can do is come down here to our option strategy overview, and this sums it up. 
This bull put credit spread allows you to play a bullish outlook by June 2nd, 2023 expiration for a historical average expected return of 54% and a historical 87% probability of profit. Since this bull put spread is out of the money, you have a 0.8% cushion if the stock drops from here with your break even price at $310.25 at expiration. Our next two sections are for data geeks. We've got the theoretical value analysis, and this goes over all of the numbers in more detail. And then you can go over things to consider, standard disclaimer about news and market conditions, events, bid ask price, early exercise risk, which is important to read. And then we've got the trade card, and this is where we started. This is our basic trade card, which gives us our entire position. And this is the trade I'm doing. Again, we've got an 87% historical win rate and 82.8% yield on this if we get a full profit and over time a 54.2% average return. Once you're in Robinhood, all you do is pull up the stock and here we've got NVIDIA. Then you wanna come over and click on Trade NVIDIA Options. We've gotta set our expiration date. In this case, it's gonna be the June 2nd. And now we want to sell a put right here. Come on, sell, there it is. And we're gonna go down to the 312.50 for the one to sell. So we're gonna click on it one time and now we're going to buy the 307.50. Click on that one time and this is our bull put credit spread, what to sell, what to buy, our total credit, what it's showing on Robinhood right now, breaks down the trade. Then all we have to do is hit continue a couple of times and boom, you have entered this trade. And now let me show you just how easy it is to place our Nvidia bull put credit spread order on Robinhood. To recap today's strategy on NVIDIA, we're doing a bull put credit spread. Our maximum gain at expiration will be realized if the stock price closes at $312.50 or higher, and the maximum gain is $225 per contract. The break-even point at expiration is $310.25, which is negative 0.8% away from the current price. And the maximum loss at expiration will occur when the stock price is $307.50 and below. And the strategy will then lose $275 per contract. Now, I really love Market Chameleon because it helps me find high percentage winning trades. Obviously, no strategy is going to win all of the time, but knowing that we have a historical model that wins 87% of the time and understanding our risks and rewards takes the guesswork out of investing and understanding options. I really like today's trade where we are risking $275 to make $225 per contract. Please understand that when we open the trade, the values might change a little bit depending on NVIDIA's current price at the market open. And I plan on doing a few other NVIDIA trades today and I'll post those for everyone in my Discord. My goal today was to show you a high percentage trade that you can copy to hopefully make some money or paper trade to learn a very valuable income strategy. Of course, I have to give the standard disclaimer that I'm not a financial advisor and that you want to do your own due diligence and draw your own conclusions. Let me know if you enjoyed this video and my process for finding winning stocks and trades. And if you want a free trial of Market Chameleon, I'll put that link in the description below. And if you want to learn more in depth about how I trade or to receive all of my trade alerts, then join my Discord. If this video helped you out, please remember to drop a like and subscribe if you want to see more content just like this. Thank you so much for watching. I'd love to see you back here on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Peace.